Hello friends, welcome to my video. In this video, we are going to see about endemic, epidemic, pandemic and sporadic diseases. At first we will see what are infectious diseases. Infectious diseases are diseases caused by infectious agents which include bacteria, fungi, viruses and parasites. To preventing the spread of infectious disease, we must understand how infectious agents spread. Infectious disease can spread in a variety of ways like direct contact such as person to person, animal to person, mother to unborn child. Infectious diseases that spread from person to person are said to be contagious. Indirect contact. Many germs can survive on an inanimate object such as tabletop, doorknob, etc. When you touch a doorknob handled by infected patient, then you can pick up the germs. Some infectious diseases are transmitted by insects or other animals and some are by consuming contaminated food or water. Some are by being exposed to organisms in the environment. Up to this we learnt what are infectious diseases and infectious agents and how infectious diseases spreading. Next we will see what are endemic, epidemic, pandemic and sporadic diseases. Let's start with endemic diseases. Diseases that are permanently present in a population within a particular geographic region are called endemic diseases. The word endemic is derived from the Greek. The prefix en means in or within. Dem means people or population. So the basic meaning of endemic is within a certain people or within a certain area. Which means an endemic disease is a disease that is always present in a certain population or region. Example malaria, an infectious disease that is endemic to Africa. Chicken pox, which is endemic to United Kingdom. Next, we'll see about epidemic diseases. An epidemic is the regional outbreak of a disease with a sudden increase in the number of cases above what is normally expected in a given population in a specific geographic area. Which means, epidemic is an outbreak that affects many people at one time and can spread through one or several communities. The word epidemic is derived from Greek. Epi means upon or above and demos meaning people and is the term used to describe a situation where a disease spreads rapidly to a large number of people in a given population over a short time period. Examples are cholera, yellow fever, seasonal flu. Next we will see what is pandemic disease. Pan, a Greek prefix means all. Pandemic is the term used to describe an epidemic. When the spread is global, the term is used to describe the rapid spread of a transmissible infectious disease over several continents or worldwide. As we all know, the latest example of pandemic is COVID-19. We must note one important point, that is, the terms pandemic and epidemic are used to describe the rate and distance of the spread of the disease and not the severity of the disease. Next we will see what are sporadic diseases. 
diseases that are seen only occasionally and usually without geographic concentration are called sporadic diseases for example in the united states tetanus is considered as sporadic the tetanus causing bacteria is present in the soil everywhere in the united states but tetanus infections are very rare before concluding we'll say the difference between endemic epidemic pandemic and sporadic diseases endemic is a disease that affects people belongs to a particular region or country epidemic is a disease that affects a large number of people within a population or region pandemic is an epidemic that spread over multiple countries or continents sporadic disease is a disease which occurs only irregularly or occasionally in a few isolated places thank you friends see you soon in my next video